guys, last season was fantastic. My predictions were wrong. This season, what teams are we going with? And I don't want anybody sitting on the fence. All right, Benson. Cleveland. Why? Second time round's the charm. <laughs> <laughs> he sounds like he actually believed that. That's cute. That's really cute. I want to just focus on who's coming. Simon. <laughs> Simon. Uh, I've, I've got to agree. The, the brain says Cleveland, and I, I've got to agree with him because I think they made the biggest signings in the off season by not signing anybody, but keeping the players that they had on their roster. Mm -hmm. So. You know, you look at K-Love, where, where was he going to go? He's staying there, you know? He and was crying got, a lot last season. He was, he was crying a lot, but you know what? He cried his way all the way back to Cleveland, you know? <laughs> so I think LeBron, if he can make it through the start of the start of the season anyway, I think Cleveland will definitely be the team that we've got to look out for. But, you know, my heart, my heart still tells me I'm a Detroit man. I'm a oh, Pistons wow. man. I'm a Pistons man, all right? The Motor City going to come correct. Right? Gonna come correct. Maybe not this season. <laughs> Interesting. If, we, if, not, if we're doing the drop in ten years' time, maybe then we would have talked about the the, the pistons actually winning. But yeah, I've got to, got to go. Got to go. Stats man. I'm I'm going with the reigning champs. Um, I I'm sticking with them. I think they've got a competitive edge over everyone else. They, they they've done it before. They um, their team hasn't changed much, so they don't have to kind of find the chemistry again. And yeah. So what, what do you think about Doc Rivers' comments about you guys getting oh, lucky? So the, everyone in the league's hating on Golden State. Everyone on the league is hating on Golden State. I'm telling you right now, you're not going back for the second time. You're not going for you're not I'm, you're not. I, first of all, I'm gonna when you say you, I am not <laughs> going for the You need to me. You need to me. You need to me. But my you point is me. it it doesn't matter. You you play eighty two games in a season and then you gotta win sixteen games after for playoffs. I don't understand how a team could be lucky. And they you know what? They went hard for it. I, 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 we were chatting about it earlier on. I can't remember a team getting as much hate after winning the championship. And and you know what? They play with a little bit of flair. They play with swag. Good. Ain't nobody Good. hating them. People just speak in their mind, all right? They're not winning as a second time. Hold up, hold up. They're, 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 they're speaking your mind, but saying listen, listen. you are lucky. Listen. You won the championship hate, hate, hate. because you are lucky. You're talking like that's I'm the one that rude. said that you're lucky. That's I didn't say rude. nothing. That that's was Doc Rivers. You're sticking up for Doc Rivers. I'm not sticking up for anybody. The only reason I like, on, the only reason why I like Golden State Warriors is because it has an African in there. <laughs> oh, that's the African that's it. If there's no African, I don't get it's true. But Frenchman. I'm gonna go for the Spurs uh, because <laughs> yeah, that was uh, Pop is the best coach in yeah. the league, mm -hmm. yeah. uh, and also you have obviously uh, Tony P, Tony Parker, Boyce Jia, mm -hmm. but you also have Paddy Mills and uh, Aldridge. What a sign! You know with that. Yeah. Uh, Aldridge and Tim Duncan inside is going to do a lot of damage, yeah. so I'm definitely rooting for them. Kawhi Leonard? Of course, you know, MVP of the finals, is improving, he stayed there, Danny Green stays there as well, they all sign uh, new contracts, it's fantastic. So, big presence inside, some sharp shooters and a great point guard. Yeah. Does anybody right. want to know who I'm going for? You, you know, you know. Boston. I want to know who you're going for, so that we don't <laughs> have any money on them because it's, it's going to be wrong. wrong. It's, it's going to be irrelevant. I think that's yeah, it's going to be wrong. Why nobody want to know my team? Who, who are you going for? Then? Well, you know, I have an emotional problems when it comes to teams, right? Mm -hmm. Because for me, it's hard. Mm -hmm. I have like two you husbands. Think you're hard, don't I know it's hard. I didn't know that it's emotional. <laughs> so Boston and the Spurs are like my husbands. I can't divorce them because I'm loyal to them, but they still have to stick around. Mm -hmm. But, but. I'm now flirting with Bops. Because <laughs> they're new on the scene, they could do something, we're not sure about them. Are we still talking and about teams who are going to win? No, wow! Why was that stuff that I was talking about? Are we talking about teams who are going to win? And then, and then, I have my bad boys, my bad boys that I, I like to have. You know, the, the hawks, the hawks, no. The hawks, <laughs> <laughs> the hawks, the no, the hawks. The hawks are still there. But my prediction for this season is going to be the Spurs, again. Thank so you. so hold on. <laughs> <laughs> so, <laughs> so, so, so we went we went all around the league. Now go back to the all husband. around the league. Now go back to the husband. Go back to the Spurs. Listen, I'm just saying. All right, you've got your prediction. I've got mine. You're sitting. You're sitting with Benson. I don't I'm gonna sit by myself. One quick question. But I'm sitting with LeBron. Why? Sorry. <laughs>